so you, 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 out of all those guys you mentioned, Greg first, um, I'm just, just reading between the lines based on what was loosely been said, because Greg has never come out to anybody, not even to any of his teammates, not even to any of the management or team owners or team managers at um, Syndicate in Santa Cruz. But in the, I basically, in the way I see it, this was going to be Greg's last year, the retirement year. And, and he, he showed that, you know, he got podium still. Um, but then the, the last two thirds of the season, you know, all, all those, all those things started happening with Greg. He's got to be in a very weird place because like you can't retire not having qualified for the final race of your final world cup, you know, like what's he going to do? Like, Hey, Oh, by the way, I, I retired and he didn't even get to do his final run. He, you know, he would never have thought that he would be in that position. And then the same way you want to, as a, as one of the goats, you want to go out on a high, um, and he sees that he can still be in touch and very much so with the, with the young guys. But I think this was going to be his retirement year. And, and then all these things happening. Now he's like, shit, I can't retire like this. I need to just knuckle down and retire next year, you know, or it'll be like Rachel's like, I want to do Fort William, then retire. But then that didn't go to plan. And, and will Greg be the same? I want to do Andorra. But then if you're going to do Andorra, you have to be race ready and you have to train like you're ready for World Cups. You can't do a few crankworks events and then race world champs and then retire. Like if you're going to be ready for world champs next year, you get to train all winter. So it's like, a, that's a, and that's a massive ask to, for a rider, especially one of Greg, that's, that's already proven everything. You know, you don't want to be like Kelly Slater wins pipe masters last year. And he's like, Oh yeah, I can still win events. And I can still maybe qualify for the Olympics. And then this year was like, he didn't really do that great. Imagine Greg does come back next year, but then he has another year like this. So well, what does he do? Like Greg, what are you going to do? Tell us. 